You know, for the last several months, I've been writing a blog about the developments and changes that I've seen in the legal marketing and sales profession in the last 10 years since I've been doing this. It occurs to me, as I also look at the world of art, that there's a comparison that we can draw there. First, Jackson Pollock. Paintings filled with design, images, splashes, complicated, complex, energetic, exciting. That's what uh, legal sales and marketing was like when I entered the scene. We had many ideas about the tools and techniques and processes that we could use. But lately, after 10 years in this business, I've been thinking about a different painter, Mark Rothko, and the simplicity and elegance of his designs. Basically, very often, three bands of color across a large canvas. And after 10 years in this business, that's what I've been thinking that law firm marketing and sales really should be simplicity as opposed to chaos. To me, it comes down to two things. After studying and thinking about this a lot, and based on a lot of literature I've been reading, particularly from BTI Group and Hellerman Barrett's Consulting, how do the buyers of legal services really go about it? And it's really elegantly simple. First and foremost, almost the only thing worth mentioning is relationships. Referrals, relationships, clients, friends in the network, that's primarily how legal services are acquired. And the second one is uh, search engines. When the networks don't deliver lawyers to be acquired, then the buyers of legal services go out and look at the search engines to find somebody who meets their needs. After 10 years, it really comes down to those two things. Uh, that's what we're going to do at Womble Carlisle. We're going to focus on relationships, and we're going to focus on findability on search engines. So we've gone from a Jackson Pollock painting to a Mark Rothko painting, and I hope you enjoy, <coughs> hope you enjoy the art that comes along with this video.